Hey, what's going on guys? Just wanted to do an update on the new frags I bought. Uh, came from Fragbox. I apologize I haven't put out a video in a couple weeks, but I wanted to wait until the uh, hair algae went away from adding that uh, new rock, uh, you see. Which it did, I, I didn't do anything. You know, it'll just go away by itself. Um, but let's uh, get into it. I mean, as you can see, I got some new softies on the bottom. There's a there's a frog spawn. There is a Aussie hammer. A Bali green slimer. And this little tiny blue Kelly tort. He actually fell off last night, so I had to uh, glue him back on. I take what I can off the frag plugs themselves as you can see there it's uh birds of paradise i apologize for not knowing the scientific names i'll hopefully uh try to learn those over this winter uh, another uh monty Poor there actually speaking of monty Poor, you should see the freebie they gave me back there you think the green dots that thing is wild don't know what species it is but it's popping but uh things are doing good i mean you see the sand all over the rocks there that's from that sand sifter i mean he does a good job but i could see me getting rid of him one day so now these two small frags were one but when i took them off the plug they split so i glued them in step places and they're called stellata and they're doing great that thing is crazy it's a two-tone it's a green nitro Monty, and uh, it's wild. Uh, there is a uh, small bonsai. I moved my encrusting Monty there, and that other one is another species of Montipora called Regis digitata. Down here, small bird's nest frag. Um, you can see the anemone's doing good. I don't really know if you remember, but I had an anemone right there. However, I had uh, some people come. I gave it away anyways. And they put it in their huge tank. Showed me pictures of a two-foot anemone. Blew my mind. And that is it. Oh, the red dragon. Can't forget that thing. That thing is sweet. Um, but I'm having troubles with the Monty. You see the Christmas tree Monty back there? And then the, the red Monty I have here. They are slowly losing color. So, you know, I've read and read red. Of course, I did the testing. All my parameters are on point. No problems there. Um, but that one, I don't know if you remember, but it, it was over here. And then I moved it there. When I saw it whiting out, I moved it back there. And... From what I read, every time you move it, you know, it'll stress. So what I'm trying to do is, is nothing. Because the main cause of Monty's whiting out can be lighting, if, if all your parameters are good. Um, my calcium, I did have a calcium swing after I put all these new frags in. Um, when I tested, it was only at 380, so quite low. Um, so I just upped my dosing. And it seems to be working fine now. So, I got uh, a chiller. I'll be doing a video on that. Even though the season's coming to an end, it was on back order. And then, uh, some more videos down below how the refugium and stuff is doing. See how dirty these pumps get? It's crazy. I actually left it dirty just so I can show you. I usually clean them quite often just because I, I can't stand looking at that, but that is nasty. However, they work extremely well, so I can't complain. That's really it for this video, guys. hope you enjoyed the new frags, and I hope you enjoy this new setup. Bye for now.